Hello viewers, this is Nurla Noor Masood. Welcome to Namura Apexify. In this video, you are going to watch how to deploy ORDS in WebLogic server and how to run Oracle Apex from it. In my previous video, I have uh, explain how to install weblogic server and con configure it and uh, how to create domain uh, if you do not uh, watch the video you can check in my description box i have already append the video link so i'm going to the main topic first of all i have to create a war file for apex images i'm going to the ords directory click it other location click on the u01 directory ords right click open in terminal and java jar or static now we have to provide our apex image directory path so u01 apex images press enter okay you see i dot war file has been created now go to the browser username web logic password click on deployments link here you will see uh, I don't deploy any app yet so just click on lock and edit click install ok ok we have to go to our ORDS directory and uh, first of all I want to install ORDS.OR next click click next I want to keep all thing as default next finish ok viewers if you want to save uh, all this information you can do uh, ok now I'm going to my another war file click install i dot war next next i want to keep it all settings as default click next button finish ok if you want to save uh, these settings you can do that but I do not want to set those now I want to activate and change this ok 
click on deployments link again and you see here is our deployments i and ords state prepared health is ok now I am going to run this app so click on control tab check both file click start and servicing all requests yes just reload the page ok see state is active health is ok now we can check our application our ORDS our file name is ORDS press enter ok you see our apex login page has come now we can check it uh, in our host browser words ok it has come internal admin sign in neighbor dear viewers you see we have uh, successfully deployed our ORDS in weblogic server and now we can run our apex application from weblogic server so viewers thank you for watching the video and uh, when you follow the video if you face any problem please ask me in the comment section and don't forget to subscribe my channel see you again in my other videos thank you very much